A new study reveals wastewater treatment plants are responsible for 23 million Americans ingesting toxic forever chemicals from their drinking water. While federal regulations are slowly catching up, the widespread contamination means many people are exposed without even knowing it. A team of New York scientists sampled water at eight different wastewater plants in the U.S. Despite existing treatment technologies to remove impurities, scientists say these molecules can withstand water filtration and enter rivers and lakes, resulting in half of Americans drinking contaminated tap water. These chemicals are commonly used in nonstick cookware, food packaging, medication, and fire suppressant. At least 75% of forever chemicals were found in treated wastewater, but scientists say none of them are on the EPA's radar. The study's lead author says we're identifying really large amounts of chemicals that we know very little about. Right now, the environmental agency only regulates six forever chemicals, leaving thousands in the water systems, serving 70% of the nation's population. Experts say these chemicals build up in the body over time, leading to long-term exposure risks. The most concerning part, these chemical compounds don't naturally break down, earning the nickname forever chemicals. Scientists have linked these chemicals to health issues like cancer, liver damage, and immune system disruption. The published research suggests climate change could worsen exposure to these chemicals. As drought diminishes lakes and rivers, there is less natural water to dilute the wastewater, potentially impacting the water supply. For Straight Arrow News, I'm Kara Rucker. For more stories like this, you can download the Straight Arrow News app or find us online at san.com.